Alohots, Hermes, welcome back for another video. So as you know, tomorrow is Mother's Day, so make sure to wish your parents, well, mainly your mom, a happy Mother's Day. So yeah, make sure to subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. Really would appreciate it if you guys could. And yeah, thank you so much to Overhaul X for being a member of the YouTube channel and to Zach Barry for finding yesterday's hidden weapon. So please make sure to keep your eyes peeled. Also, if you ever want to join Devoted, please make sure to join the Discord server link in the description. Also, I spent over 2,500 gems for this event. That's insane, you know? Please let me know in the comment section down below how many gems you spent. I had to speed this by eight times. Guys, eight times speed because this thing just took me so long to do. And it was just never ending. It took about 11 minutes of recording, guys. Just 11 minutes in order to get every single thing in this event. 2,500 gems gone just for this one event. I remember in the last event, I spent like 1,800 gems. Like, I thought that wasn't bad. I thought that was like a major steal for me, you know. And in today's video, I spent 2,500 gems trying to get the whole entire event. That is so expensive. This is also an example of a devoted black market, which is like super cool. So like, I have so many battle pass credits offers. And so some people told me in VC, just get it for the video. So I was like, you know what? I might as well. So if you want to join devoted, you know, link in the description, just join the Discord server, guys. And just tell me in general, because our application thing is kind of closed right now. So yeah, but I just thought... It was a lot of credits. I'm not going to buy all of them, but now I have over 70,000 bow pass cards. 74,000 actually, to be exact. But yeah, so this is actually a mix of recording from like the earlier today and like later in the day because at the time of the video, I actually was doing homework and I was just like, you know what? I might as well go on my phone, mess around on Pixel Gun for a little bit because like, why not? And also, I didn't forget why you guys came to this video. So let's get into that part of the video. So as you know, tomorrow is my mother's day so please make sure to wish your mom a happy mother's day okay guys if you don't have a mom um just celebrate mother's day i guess okay but we could be looking at a lot of pink weapons due to the fact that like every mother's day there's always something pink related i have no clue why whatsoever but yeah I, it's just, just everything is pink okay you know it's mother's day and mother's day is just some day to just you know celebrate having a mom and everything you know and yeah personally I think Succubus would be a cool trader van weapon if it did come back because it kind of fits the Mother Day vibe, you know? Like, Love Spell as well. And then this Easter Bazooka is kind of a Mother Day vibe in some sort of way, but it is also an Easter weapon. But, you know, please let me know in the comment section down below on other weapons I also miss. I also feel like the Carrot Sword was also, like, kind of a Mother's Day weapon, but I didn't use it in today's video because it's, like, super underleveled as well. But, yeah, this is a loadout I'm using today, which is, like, super cool. Anyways, I personally think, you know, Succubus could come back tomorrow just due to the fact that it is Mother's Day tomorrow. And that's pretty cool. You know, it's only once a year. Remember that, guys. It's just always a good thing to be happy all the time. All right. Oh, my God. I swear. Have you guys noticed something? There's so many AI in this game that it's just they have aimbot. I swear. Their aim is better than my aim. Like, my aim is so bad lately. I also thought of a chance of Ashbringer coming back. I don't know. Ashbringer seems like one of those weapons that would come back on a van like this because we have actually waited a lot. I believe we waited like four plus days for a new trader van. And that's pretty, that's a pretty decent amount of time because trader vans usually last from like, I believe one to three days or so. Not, they're not this long, but it's because of the new update. You know, it took a bit of time from like iOS and Android, you know, to get the update. So it does make sense why this van was long, but I did get all of the trader van weapons. So I hope tomorrow's van is a very special van because it is Mother's Day. Remember that. And yeah, if like Laser Cycler and Necklace of the Ice King came back, I would be so happy because I need Necklace of the Ice King and Laser Cycler on my Devoted 2 account. Also, if you want to join Devoted 2, it's free to join. You know, you don't have to have Discord to join the server. But if you do have Discord, I recommend joining the server because like, why not? We're there every single day. And yeah, personally, I thought Romeo and Juliet would be like a cool van weapon. But I think this weapon is in the armory. I have actually no clue. So someone please let me know if Romeo and Juliet is actually in the armory. So... We'll be using actually AG's loadout for like today's video because like why not? Let's end the video off strong. But so we could be seeing a lot more feminine weapons or a lot of really OP weapons tomorrow because tomorrow's van, I I mean, okay, listen, it should be special. We waited a long time and, you know, I would might as well get something good. You know, I hope some OG weapons are coming back because I personally need some really cool weapons. You know, I don't want to get anything else. I have all the armory weapons. I'm done now. I don't know what to do anymore. A few life goals now are to get Heart of Volcano, Pumpkin Mask, 
and some other cool stuff in the game that's it get to 800 weapons but then like i don't know what to do after that i don't know uh, sad life guys for me but so i don't have the battle pass sniper due to the fact i'm just grinding the tiers i personally don't like buying all the tiers because you know it's just not something i like doing so i'm just grinding up the battle pass so i decided to upgrade my real gun today in today's video i have not used this sniper in so long you know i don't i think the last time i used this sniper was like two years ago guys two years ago i have not used it ever since and yeah one punch gauntlet is 100 percent recommended for melee zones this melee is super good 100 percent recommending this melee if you ever want to get it this is a good loadout eg good loadout man i hope you did enjoy this video please make sure to drop a like subscribe anyways i'll see y'all later